It's the MacCast with Susan and Dave, and we're competing for your love. Please. Oh. You know I win anyway. Check us out. We're putting community back in commerce. <laughs> Welcome back to the MacCast. We are so excited to be here today. My name is Dave Hansen. I am a proud member of the Murray Chamber of Commerce and on the board of directors. And I'm here with my co-host, <laughs> Susan Bond, the Bond girl. Yes. And who is also a member of the chamber and a proud member of the, the board, of directors. board of directors. And yep. we are so excited today because we have here with us today the big man on campus, the BMOC of Murray, the big Murray on campus. He is the mayor, the rhyming mayor. Mayor Blair, Yay. Mayor Blair Camp, Yay. thank you for coming today. Thank we, you, thank you for having me. You're, we are so thrilled to have you. And you know what, the the thing about what you do bring to the city is such a history. It's, you've been involved in so many levels, and we are thrilled because the Murray City does so much with the Murray Chamber, but also we just love how you've been involved for so long, and we just adore you. So tell us a little bit how you got started working with Murray City. Okay, well, I my history with Murray goes back a long time. Mm -hmm. uh, we moved to Murray, my wife and I, in 1975. In 1979, oh, wow. had the opportunity to, to join the fire department in Murray. And uh, it was a great career uh, in Murray. And uh, yeah, I'm the short guy with the mustache. Oh, yeah. Check that <laughs> out. Check him out. Doing uh, the mustache. This was back in the early 80s, but um, had a great career. 26 years uh, with, with Murray City. I uh, had the opportunity to serve as assistant chief and as fire chief uh, for the last six years I was uh, there in, in Murray, served as the fire chief. So uh, at that time I decided, you know what, I think it, I, I want to do something else, I want to try something else. So uh, I retired from the fire department and went uh, off to do something else. But lo and behold, I found out that I really loved the fire service. and. <laughs> So I came back to the fire service and actually did another five years uh, as the fire chief in Provo City. So uh, I had the opportunity to, to work in, in two cities. But of course, uh, my first love has always been Murray. And of course, that's where our home is. And, and so uh, when I left uh, Provo, decided it would be a good time to, to give back to the city that's, that's such a great city. Mm -hmm. And uh, so I decided to run for city council. Oh, yay. Okay. And yeah. uh, ran for city council and uh, was elected to represent District 2. And uh, great opportunity. But t uh, about midterm, uh, I started having uh, conversations with, uh, with Mayor Iyer, who became a very good friend. And uh, Oh, we got you here. Let's, oh, let, there, we, there go. we go. Mayor Iyer. Oh, yes, yes. Um, and uh, when he indicated to me that he wasn't going to be able to run again uh, for mayor, he, he really started talking to me about... Uh, if I was interested in doing that. And I had a lot of people over the years say, why don't you run for mayor? Mm -hmm. And I'd always laugh and say, I'd why? I don't want to be the mayor. You know, and, and Mayor and Mayor Iyer was an amazing man and it's it's it makes my heart happy to know that you not only are, are helping him, you know, finish his legacy and building your own, but it's just such a, it, it was such a camaraderie, you know, when you ran. And, mm -hmm. and again, it's an election and it was wonderful and, and all the candidates were fantastic. But my, my heart's happy that you're in office now and that you're able to continue the mission. Well, thanks, mm -hmm. Susie. That's yeah. nice of you to say. But, uh, yeah, he was... Uh, he he was a great uh, mentor as a person. Mm -hmm. uh, he just was a great leader, and and we became fast friends in a short period of time. Mm -hmm. I also received some encouragement from from another former mayor, Lynn Pat, uh, who was a great leader in the uh, in the city uh, for many years. In fact, uh, our our golf course is named for him. Uh, he was mm -hmm. the. He was the, uh, I was going to say the architect, but there's actually a, an architect, <laughs> yeah. for, but he, he's the brain uh, trust of the golf course, and, and that's why it's named after him, as well as the great Murray Parkway. Oh, yeah. uh, so he also uh, encouraged me uh, t to run. So but with, with that kind of encouragement, uh, I had to really give it uh, consideration. So oh, yeah. had the opportunity to, to finish the last four months of Mayor Iyer's term after he passed away and then was elected to, to serve a four-year term. And see, mentorship is so important. Yeah. And and to have that kind of a lead and to have people that are encouraging you on that level, that obviously is, I, I'm excited that you followed through with that and you did that. And we at the Chamber are very excited about how you get involved with us and how you how you work with, the, the city works with us so closely and, and is always willing to, to lend a hand and participate. You come out to our ribbon cuttings and, and all the great things. And so that always is a good thing. One of the things that was always dear to me 
as a member of the chamber, we'd go to these different events and, and you would be there, mm -hmm. you know, be it on the city council and then when you became mayor. And me as just a, just a Murray chamber member, which was just kind of the low man on the totem pole, <laughs> I thought, but, but you remembered who I was. Yes. And you'd always say, hey, Dave, hey, yes. come here. And you'd say hi to me. And that meant a lot to me, mm -hmm. you know, as, as, a, as a business owner in your city, having the mayor or someone from the city remember who I was when I met you, that, that really meant a lot to me. So thank you for that uh, just personal touch that you bring to the city of Murray. Yeah, thank you. It's it's really great to be out to the events that the chamber puts on, and we really appreciate being part of that. I spent a couple of years on the chamber board too, and uh, so the, so you know the drill. The cha I know the drill. <laughs> <laughs> the chamber peeps are my peeps. Yeah, so, that's a good thing. Uh, all right, now I want to talk about something uh, in particular here. Um, we had to skip over this picture, but it is back. <laughs> and and where where has it gone? Where have you gone, Joe DiMaggio? The nation turns us lonely as you. Where have you gone, Mr. Mustache Man? Yes. When, uh, you gotta love that. When is this going to come back? And <laughs> how soon? Maybe soon. You Maybe soon. Know. You never know. So, but what? See, see, when your hair changes colors and you know, it becomes so salt and pepper, you know. <laughs> you know, you need to. But, but yeah. now it's all salt, so. Yeah. <laughs> now we have, but there are some big changes coming up with Murray. That's yes. really exciting. And and do tell us, because again, what what the Matcasts are all about is we're we're putting community back in commerce, which is why we're so excited to have the mayor here. It, tell us a little bit about some of the amazing things that you guys are working on to really make great things happen in the local area. Okay, yeah. And as a backdrop to that, let me just first mention what a, what a great business climate we have oh, yeah. currently. And shopping is, is amazing in Murray. We have a, a regional shopping center that participates in the community and in the chamber mm -hmm. that's very successful. And we've be become known as uh, a place of, of healing, if you will, uh, with the uh, the large medical center and, and clinics and and so forth. So uh, yeah, we've uh, we've we've got a great climate, a great business climate. But what's exciting is is that we ha also have a downtown redevelopment area mm -hmm. that we're we're working to uh, to bring out of the dust, uh, yep. and uh, that um, that includes uh, the area directly. Uh, west of where our current city hall is and uh, a little bit to the northwest actually and we've just started building a new headquarters fire station they're just they're oh, just moving dirt that's fantastic. this week yeah. and uh, and that that'll be uh, be finished in about a year and we're starting on our new city hall uh, which will uh, w which we hope uh, will will drive some redevelopment in that area we believe it will we have a lot of uh, of area there that that's uh, going to be redeveloped and another opportunity for new businesses and new partners in the community to come in. Exactly, and I know as, as part, of, we're part of the Murray Chamber, we're also part of the National Chamber of Commerce. Utah has the best commerce, uh, that is the best in commerce for the state of Utah, for all of the 50 states, and then Murray is right here in the heart of the valley, the heartbeat of it. Um, you mentioned the mall. I know the mall is one of the largest producing malls on the West Coast, so or the Western area, western, I should, western states. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it's something that, um, you make a big impact with what you do. It, it, especially, I, I love we do the parades. I get to judge the parade. And yeah. Murray <laughs> always shows up so beautifully. I love the trucks. I love the teams. You, you, love, great you love being the judge. I do. I, I can't <laughs> lie. I do enjoy being the judge of the parades. But, but it's, my heart gets happy. I'm proud to be a part of the Murray Chamber, and that's why we're really excited to have you here. And thank you for all you're doing, because it, it makes a big difference. I, I mean, it's definitely it's improved our business and our life, um, just being a part of the Murray Chamber. And again, guys, if, if you want the skills, you want the additional benefits to get involved, find out more about the Murray Chamber. Go to murraychamber.org and learn about the free resources that are available to all. And then again, some of the amazing benefits available to the members. If you're interested in being on a podcast, please visit murraychamber.org and tell us all about yourself. And we want to be here with you, interviewing you, because we're interviewing industry leaders. And in the meantime... Well, just know, in the meantime, well, first, we want to say thank you so much for being here at Murray Camp. And thank you. in the meantime, keep, keep making, making good, good things, things happen. happen.
Do you ever feel like you just need some support to get really healthy? Hi, I'm Scott Mitchell. And I'm Melanie Douglas. I'm on a journey to find lasting health in my everyday life. And I'm here to help. We'll find fun, doable ways to improve your health through small and simple changes. It's the Really Healthy Podcast. Subscribe for free on iTunes or the KSL News Radio app.